Hey y'all, what up? It's your girl, Liza Koshy, and these are my GQ essentials. Oh, this is a fresh pot too. I'm so excited, look at that. This situation, now unwrap it before your eyes. Actually, it might get everywhere. This is powdered peanut butter. This situation, I'm about to put you on. This is so good in smoothies, yogurt, ice cream. You can put it into like a, a peanut sauce. If you take a little bit of this, mix it with water, mix it with soy sauce and honey. It's an amazing salad dressing. Let's get into it. I mix this with water and mixing it with yogurt too just like extends it into this massive peanut butter batter. And I just go in. I love peanut butter so much. Does anybody have a peanut allergy in here? Literally, this just being in the air will set you off. You got an EpiPen? You good? Okay, that's that. Panty liners. <laughs> this is my next essential, and it's not what you think it's for. It's not for my downstairs. This is actually for my upstairs. This is for my armpits. Nice! <laughs> so this is a hack that I learned on set and from just being a puddle of sweat. Thanks, Dad. Pass down that jean hard. So what you do is you actually tape this to the inside of the fabric of your shirt. It absorbs your sweat. That way you don't stain your shirt. And like, let's totally normalize sweat stains. You're putting in work, sweat, baby, sweat. But if you're on camera or for whatever reason, you'd rather not have it there, this is a great hack. You can also put it on your back, and I do. I'm covered in 37 panty liners a day. This is my big boy. This is my son. I love the air fryer, okay? I'm especially passionate about the air fryer. This is God's hot breath, baking my food. I uh, call myself Avatar the Last Air Fryer. Quiz me anything, give me, give me any kind of vegetable, poultry, fish. Cauliflower. 370, 15 minutes. Anybody else? Zucchini. Zucchini, 370, 15 minutes. Anybody else? Chicken. 400. 35. <laughs> <laughs> I love it so freaking much. It's so easy to meal prep in this buddy. Yeah, I love creating like little portions throughout the week. I basically, I'm Octomom when I meal prep. I make like eight meals for myself, not for my kids. So this, I douse myself in perfume. Did I watch Sydney Sweeney's GQ Essentials? I did, I sprayed on my ankles now, thanks Sid. But this is a special perfume that my mom actually hunted down for me. I broke mine while traveling and it cracked open in my bag and I smelled amazing for weeks. But it was all over my clothes and now my mom went hunting for this specific one and I love it, so. Because of Sydney, I sprayed on an ankle. I can't because I'm wearing really cute boots that you can't see. Thanks a lot. You want a pan? You want a pan? Thank you. Thank you. I wanted them featured so bad. I thrifted them. Thank you. Okay, back up here. Thank you. This situation goes on the wrist, goes behind the ear, neck, armpit, downstairs, back porch, everywhere. But I love this situation. I always get compliments on it. And I used to be fearful of wearing perfume because they say if you wear perfume, you're not emitting your pheromones and you'll attract the wrong mate. Super weird. But uh, I started to uh, attract the wrong men in my life, so I'm more perfume. <laughs> so these little baby shoes that look like they should be hung up on a Christmas tree are actually my cult shoes. They're my Soul Cycle shoes. I did sell my soul. Uh, my soul and my ass belongs to Soul Cycle. I Soul Cycle on the regular degular. I love it so much. It's like you can jam out to EDM, you click your shoes in, and you just cycle to like a concert in the dark. Like two years ago, I fully passed out in a cycle class and you just saw these shoes just spinning on their own. I had to slip them off and I walked out into the really white, aggressively light lobby and I got a free apple juice and a free class. So if you want a free class, just pass out in one. Next. Yeah. <laughs> this is a plant, but it's also essential. This is RC, baby. I'm so proud. And so my whole voice changed right now because this is the character that I voice in Transformers. I'm super stoked to be voicing this fierce Autobot. It is actually the second time that we're gonna be seeing RC in a live action film, but she has a storyline this time and I'm so excited for you know her existence in the universe to be honored. She is a Ducati 916. So she is a Ducati body baby and she's like transforms. Hold on, wait, let me see. I'm so honored, I'm so excited to give one of these, right? We're ordering 55 for all my little cousins and nieces and nephews, thank you. This is my mumu, my kaftan. My Texan is screaming, my, actually my Indian is screaming more so, my Texan is yodeling, but both sides of my culture wear large 
large pieces of fabric around the house and to bed. And I love this one so much. I just got it, I'm super stoked about it. It's gonna have like my face oil stands all over it very soon. So I'm glad it's clean today for your viewing. But this is so silky, so soft, so massive. And I used to wear giant t-shirts as a kid growing up and then I graduated into a woman and now I wear my mumus. And I'm gonna slip into this right after this shoot because this, it's tight. I have been lit on fire once with the Moo Moo that it's a lot of fabric, so you just gotta make sure you're careful when you cook. The most relaxing article of clothing that you can possibly put on your body. These are my gummies. Look, this is the one piece of my childhood that is really hard for me to lay to rest, okay? I know I'm a full grown ass woman, but it is hard to not eat, as an adult, a fruit snack pack of gummies every single night. This is what I look forward to at the end of the day. Don't take this away from me. I love these guys. I like don't eat candy, but yeah, I do. I do. Ah, I love the happy one. I love the gummy worms, the prenatal. That makes me feel powerful as a woman. Yeah, these two are my favorite. I love them so much. The lion's mane too. I love a shroom gummy. <laughs> This is my little baggie of herbs. This is actually a gift from my sister and I was so hesitant to burn it for so long. It's a sage stick, it's got these beautiful flowers in it and I finally burnt it maybe like a week ago and I've had such good energy in my life since then so I blame my sister for my health. And then this is my Palo Santo. I love the smell of it so freaking much. I huff it on the daily. I like do a whole like little dance right before I go to sleep. Yeah, I'm that girl. But I like dance around my dog a little bit. I'll dance around like my head. I'll give my head like good thoughts, clear thoughts, good intentions for the next day. And then I'll knock out and go to sleep with a crystal under my pillow. I've lived in LA for so long now. Oh, that's my dog's hair. If you burn that, it brings good luck too. Yeah, speaking of my family, this is my beautiful family. This is actually my sister's masked pandemic wedding. So <laughs> we were all wearing masks. We're all pointing at the happy couple as my brother-in-law and my other brother-in-law, right? I'm so freaking lucky. I'm a mix, definitely a mix of my mom and dad. And yeah, honored to be that. Yeah, love my fam. I'm about to go visit them right now and go get drunk over the course of a three day long weekend at a family reunion. Very excited for it. Okay, these are what I had too much of this morning. This is caffeinated chocolate. This is a great boost at 3 p.m. I have my coffee in the morning and then when I start to feel that slump, this is a half a cup of coffee. Get in there. See that? One bite equals half a cup of gel. And I love these guys. I toss them out everywhere I go. Think fast. Nice, dude! One hand wonder over there. What's up? Oh, sorry. <laughs> you thought it was over. This is Phoebe Waller, bitch. This is my girl. Phoebe Waller-Bridge is an incredible actress. I love so freaking much. And I named my girl after her. So Phoebe, you can't go wrong with the Phoebes. There's Phoebe from Friends, Smelly Cat. But when she uh, got Fleas, the title of Phoebe Waller-Bridge's series is called Fleabag. When she got Fleas, I was so proud. So upset, so proud. Thanks, DQ. Those are my essentials. Now I gotta get out of here. I gotta fly. I got a flight to catch, but I wanted you to see my full fit. Thank you. <laughs> 